right now having a beer and just watching the sunset Callie is currently inside cooking some dinner I made some homemade guacamole and we're making some rice we're gonna make like little DIY chipotle bowls so um I'm making some lime cilantro cilantro and lime rice and Callie's making some chicken um like fajita type things and um yeah we're just chilling right now we're making the best of this quarantine we did go out today and um get some groceries some more groceries for like the next week or two or so so um yeah we're prepared we kind of didn't want to go anywhere but we needed groceries the first week that i was here i'm now pretty much going on my second week the first week i wanted to be up and down up and down because like i love going places with her because she don't mind that i take forever i mean at least not all the time she don't mind that i take forever looking around places and it's so weird because everything's closed and stuff but now that it's already the second week i kind of am just chilling here at the apartment we got um patio furniture so i'll show y'all really quick and um yeah we're working on getting some furniture for the living room right now we're kind of looking around at some couches um we didn't really want to finance anything because we did just get a freaking new car so um we're trying to see if we can buy one off someone um we just haven't found the perfect one yet but we're hoping to do that soon um but yeah let me update y'all on the little patio situation we got going on right now and yeah we'll go from there child she doesn't want to come all the way out i don't think she really likes how high it is kind of but um yeah she's kind of just sitting up there but let me show y'all this is our little patio table we noticed that freaking everywhere and the people under us as well have the same freaking table um this is my beer this is our little cactus he came in another little pot but we just depotted it and then we put him in here we put some little rocks to help him stand up because he was a little chueco and then if i move over to this side we have some cute little chairs um they're just white chairs they were super inexpensive at walmart they were about 10 bucks each and then we just got these cute little pillows and then these chairs have like a little foam stand which is great you just like slip your little phone in there and that's pretty much our situation we got going on right now flipping it up in here how's it going huh? how's it going yeah <laughs> Make it look like it's chipotle lettuce, but it's not. <laughs> we have some chicken with some peppers and some onions up in there. Freaking smells great. I wish that y'all could smell it. She's a little mama's baby. She follows me everywhere. Empty in here, like I said, we're working on getting some more furniture. We were gonna mount our TV here, but we think that we're gonna put like a cute shelf and then like set the TV on top and then like add some little frames and stuff like that. We're not sure yet Callie bought her some more little toys she plays with toys now and <laughs> that's our little situation we have going on now we're making it a lot more homey and cozy for us I'm trying to sit down I'm trying to put this pillow but I'm excited the homesickness is under control um I still get a little bit homesick, but I feel better now a little bit. It's hard. I call my family every single day. So um, I think that's the ma the hardest thing about moving is the fact that I get homesick really bad. Like I got homesick super bad whenever I moved to Corpus. Now I'm states away, not even 45 minutes. I'm states away, so about 23 hours. So that's the hard thing but um i mean it gets better every day i wish there was things open so we can go and occupy our time a little bit more but like doing things but um just so i can get my mind off it some because like i said some days are worse than others but we're going good it's going fine i'm happy i'm excited to be here and to be decorating and stuff so that's that's really good this whole video was going to be dedicated to my coffee but I had to delete that video and now I'm going to refilm it more than likely in the morning. Um, but I'll see if I can get Callie to get up and help me record it. Um, I was just showing a little too much in that other video and I just was a little uncomfortable about it. So I'm going to refilm it, um, but I'm going to stick it in this video. So that way this video is not just like a short little coffee video. I'm going to go into a, um, depth about how I make my coffee. 
uh, my lattes it's an iced vanilla latte so I'm gonna go into depth about how I do that but I'm going to do that tomorrow but as for today we're just going to eat sit lay down for a little while probably watch um, the new season of Ozark and then probably knock out today it was a long day but a very productive it was a good day so um yeah so this is how they came out they look actually freaking bomb we got the rice at the bottom the black beans the corn the chicken with all the peppers cheese guacamole sour cream and then i made a salsa the other day so i'm freaking excited to tear this up and yeah i'm gonna cut this video short because i'm hungry and she already went at it <laughs> how is it very good yeah you a chef yeah <laughs> currently in the kitchen we decided to move our mattress and the tv and stuff to the living room <laughs> since it's empty and don't mind my hair i look like freaking joe dirt but um <laughs> <laughs> we decided to move everything over here because it's empty and we just i don't know for some reason <laughs> wanted to move over here but <laughs> i'm whipping up my coffee over here i wanted to make one of these coffees i made cali a caramel macchiato but i literally am, i come to the living room right because she's like very quiet and i see her starting to record things look what she did to the tv <laughs> the fact that it's underneath the fireplace though I cannot with her and then she's just sitting here in her little bed we have a fireplace in here behind everything that's why we were saying we wanted to mount a TV not this one a big we're gonna buy a bigger one but we wanted to mount the TV but I think we're gonna put like a cute shelf thing on top of here and place the TV on that and then add like frames or plants or like some kind of decor because um, we don't want it to look too plain with just the TV, but I see she almost tripped, I'm, I cannot. She's showing off her new Starbucks cup. She bought a new Starbucks cup today. The second we freaking got it, I spilled coffee all over it. My coffee tipped over in the basket. Do you remember she was asleep? She was asleep. Morning guys, it is currently 9.30. I brought my dog to the dog park. I walked her literally all over the apartment complex and now we're here at the dog park, so. I went for a good walk this morning. I'm really, really tired. I literally went to sleep so late last night. I was just having the worst anxiety ever. Like, I started crying. I was just like, what the heck is going on? And I don't know, somehow I finally fell asleep, thank God. I just kept like praying, 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 and I finally fell asleep, so. I only woke up because she was whining. She needed to come to the restroom. She was like barking, not barking, but like, you know how they do that little ugh, ugh. <laughs> That's what she kept doing, so I was like, oh, I just woke up. I brought her for a walk and I'm just letting her run around here in the dog park. But that's pretty much my update as of right now. Um, we don't plan on going anywhere. Right as soon as I go back home, I'm going to freaking sanitize everything because, um, yeah, I am going to do that because like, all this stuff is freaking crazy. Like, I never took it not serious like this whole time but now like hearing so much things about it i'm like extra precautious i should have brought my clorox my clorox wipes but i didn't but um i'm just taking like a lot of extra precaution because it's only me and cal and if one of us gets sick we both get sick because it's only us there you know what i mean and so um yeah i'm just trying to take some extra precaution and we're gonna stay home we got groceries yesterday i don't know if i mentioned that we got groceries yesterday for the next like good couple weeks maybe we can stretch it to three weeks so we'll see but um here's my child she jumped on the bench but yeah i'm gonna try and get her to finish up so i can go back inside and wash my hands because that's all i think about when i'm not at home is i need to go wash my hands i need to go to the effect so yeah y'all better be staying safe this is her new little collar um callie bought her a new collar yesterday it's so freaking cute um she usually wears her little vest but when we're here at the apartment she don't need to wear it so um, we got her just a little color so she could be a little bit more comfortable. Um, obviously, if we take her, like, out in public, she'll wear her little vest. But for right now, she's chilling. She's a little cold. I probably should have put her vest on her. But nice morning, Raymond. She wants to sit here on mom. Okay, so it's about 11.30 in the morning. I cleaned the whole house. Well, almost the whole house. Not really. Like, I disinfected, wiped everything down. I sold everything, washed the dishes, washing the clothes now. Because we were out and about 
the last couple days like grocery shopping and stuff so I'm trying to get everything washed so that we were good to stay here for the next few days. This one's still asleep. She don't get up. I'm sick. That's why. No, you're not. Stop telling people that. Are you really sick? I don't know. She's been feeling a little under the weather, but it, I think it's just her allergies because there's so much freaking pollen. Oh, bless you. There's so much pollen everywhere. And um, whenever we went to go get the patio furniture the other day, everything was covered in pollen. So I'm thinking she just has allergies. I'm not sure yet. If she's sick, I'm sick. So. <laughs> my child is barely getting up she was asleep with Callie this whole time and that's our update as of right now our quarantine check-in it is currently what time uh, one o'clock made myself a little latte a hot one today I made Callie a macchiato which she is drinking over there on the floor she made another little setup today in the living room I'm currently making us some Tostino's pizza because we were hungry and we're trying to use all of the food that she bought previously so we're just cooking up random things here and there for dinner we're probably gonna make some chicken alfredo so yeah we're just making that up we're gonna watch some ozark the new season we started it last night but we fell asleep halfway and now we're gonna start it all over again so that's what we're doing that's a little quarantine checkup and let me get show y'all exactly what callie's up to over there she didn't bring the mattress over today, just the just the blanket. And she didn't put all her boxes today. She just put the chairs. So <laughs> her little macchiato that I made her and my child means. We're gonna get to filming the coffee recipe today as well. Um, later on in the day. We're having hot coffee right now and then later on I'll have an iced coffee, maybe. So I'm about to start cleaning, cooking, and yeah, I'm kinda hungry, so. She's yelling at you, mama. No, I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> oh, baby's goodie. <laughs> I'm not sure you comprehend how poorly the cartel war is going for Navarro. Just pisses me off. It's another day and like day four stuck inside this apartment. We go out for little things like grocery shopping and stuff like that. But as far as everything else, we're pretty much here. Um, but yeah, I just had an end the vlog that I recorded a couple days ago. So I'm just going to do that now. We're just watching Tiger King and laying here. We did get a, a little couch, which we love. We both fit on it, including our brat of a dog child but um yeah i will see you all in my next video i hope you like this video if you did enjoy my hair give this video a thumbs up and i will see you all in my next one